on, man. I can see him hitting you. Call your hit. Okay, two things wrong with this scenario. First thing, Miyagi is obviously not calling his hits. Let's rewind the tape. Dude. And second thing, I let it get to me. Come on, man. I can see him hitting you. Call your... These are against the core rules of Airsoft. Now, let's see where this goes. Your hits! You're not hitting me! Call your own hits! Look, dude, I can see him hitting you. Stop cheating! What? Cheating? What are you kidding me? You Will Ferrell looking m Hey, why don't you stop worrying about my looks? Hey, how's that new album coming, Miyagi? You f hack? You can't see the BBs hitting me from that far away, howdy doody. Dude, you're the worst, what are man. What you talking about? You're a complete joke. My hits. What? You're a joke. Your music man. blows. What? You yeah, said you yeah, liked my you music. You heard me. No, it's ridiculous. What? It's for Come kids. On. What? I'm so tired of it. To start your skirmish day the right way, begin with a well-balanced nutritional breakfast. Airsoft Riotos are a special blend of bio and competition grade BBs that give you that boost you need in the field. Now with zero grams trans fat, you can keep your caloric intake down while gaining peak performance. Riotos, why not? Hey guys, today we're gonna talk about honor and calling hits. Uh, the game of Airsoft is designed to put the officiating on the player's shoulders. It's up to you to call your own hits. Call your hits. Um, unlike paintball, there are no marking projectiles to determine that someone has been shot. I'm sure that this is an ongoing issue in every Airsoft community uh, throughout the world, and it's the most frustrating part of the game. I said call your hits. A lot of fields internationally have game control, so that helps everyone to have their presence on the field. It keeps everyone honest. Uh, some fields, however, don't have it, and it all comes down to individual integrity. Now, there are two sides to this issue's coin, shooter and target. Let's take a look at what we think might be the reasoning behind the hit calling issue from both perspectives. We'll start with the shooter's perspective. I've heard this a million times, and I've probably said it even more. I shot that guy like 50 times and he still didn't call his hits. Well, there's no way I didn't hit that guy. As if to say there's no way my badass gun and my pure awesomeness didn't light that guy up. Well, this is where the frustration comes in. Um, the truth is, you don't know. So you're not in cover with him watching the BBs hit all around him. Give the player the respect you would expect. Uh, don't get frustrated. Get closer and get another angle. Now, on the other hand, there's times when you can't see the BBs bouncing off somebody's tack vest or helmet, another piece of gear. Once again, don't get angry. Get closer, flank, get another angle, or call in sniper support. Make them pay for their cheating ways. Okay, from the target's perspective, the player might not feel the hit on his or her loadout. The hit might come from a weird angle, so they might feel and think it's a ricochet. Uh, they might be coming through some heavy bush and think the BB hitting them is a branch or something like that. It happens to all of us. But there are the other instances and other players. Call your hit! We don't know why these hits aren't called. Maybe the player just respawned, crossed a ton of field, got to the line and immediately got hit with a grazing BB and thought, man, I really don't want to hike back to respawn. Too bad. Take your lazy ass back to respawn, better yet, run back to respawn, and get out there and help your teammates. Hey, and get some ammo while you're there. Miyagi, pull me up. <clears throat> Maybe the player doesn't care about objectives and just wants to shoot people in the face. I've seen the dialogue on some national forums. These players are out there. If this is you, don't go to the games that people spend a lot of time and effort putting together and planning that are a lot of heavy milsim based with multiple objectives. Go out in the woods with your like-minded friends and hunt each other all day if you like that, but keep it off the mature player's fields. Maybe the player just doesn't care and has a cheating heart. We don't know. All we know is you need to stop. You make the game not fun. Look, man, call your damn hits. Uh, Airsoft is a game, yes, but people spend a lot of time away from their families and a lot of money on gear and treat this as a sport. Don't ruin it for us because you're a douchebag with no self-respect. 
Another issue we want to cover is dead men don't talk. Too many times I've had guys walking back to respawn as I'm coming out and say, there are two men on the left side of the road, or there's a sniper on the berm 100 yards out. And I always reply with, dead man can't talk. Didn't you hear him? Dead man can't talk. Uh, don't give away people's positions. That's just not cool. If you have younger players in your community that are guilty of these traits, it's your responsibility as a community to straighten them out. Mentor them to play with respect and have self-discipline and integrity. If you have older players with these issues, that's a whole other story. Break his kneecaps. We just wanted to address these issues because they bother us, and we're sure they bother you too. Airsoft is a game of honor. Let's keep it that way.